Hey guys. So, this morning, like every other, really, these days, I'm going for a walk. And it's a nice day. Surrounding myself with some nature. Getting out of the house, you know. A lot of people think, you know, they see the number of hours I have in game or, you know, whatever they think. I never make time to go outside, but I do. It might be a surprise to you all, but I wouldn't want to miss out on all this. So, <clears throat> it's not quite, not quite noon yet. It's still the morning. Sun's just about right overhead. Blue skies all around, surrounded by green trees and grass, you know. It's a nice day. And it looks like there's no one else here in the park. Um, but yeah, I've, I've started adding some, some walking to my, uh, daily routine, you know, get up early. I actually, um, I kind of heard about it as, as a good method for, for kind of getting in shape, you know, wake up on an empty stomach, just go for a walk, you know, walk, walk 30 minutes one way. When you reach your destination, turn around. I've already been walking for about about an hour, and then, uh, you know, but I'm having a good time, so I'm just gonna keep it going, I guess. And I found, I found after doing this for, for a little while that it's not only a good way to get some exercise, but it's also a good way to kind of clear your mind, you know? It can, it can have a psychological benefits too, you know? You, you can just walk around, have a have no stress, just sort of collect your thoughts, think about the day, plan plan the rest of your day. That's what I spend a lot of time doing here is like thinking about, you know, what am I going to do next in my life or, I don't know, thinking about this video, you know, I, oh, look at this, there's some corn on the ground, interesting. Um, yeah, just gives you some time to think. Maybe, maybe uh, you could listen to an audiobook. Maybe you could listen to some music, or maybe you could just, I don't know if you can hear it, but listen to the natural sounds of the world. Hear those birds chirping, playing those polyrhythmic bird sounds. I moved down here to Southern California like about a year ago, and I, I don't know enough about this area, so I figured this is another good way to, to explore, to kind of know what what's around me you know this is my first time in this park first time walking this trail I never knew this was here until I came out and went for a walk you know so but now look at this now I know that this is here so if I'm ever in the mood for just this I can come right back so maybe I'm trying to do some like I don't know Civil War reenactments look at this big open field Perfect. Or maybe I want a water balloon fight. Got some trees over there. You know, it's the perfect scenery for, for that perfect moment, you know? And, and now I know, and so do you. So I'm leaving one park and heading across the street to another. I don't think I'm gonna get run over. I'm going, I feel like Frogger. Let's go, and another trail. So much more to explore. There's a bunny rabbit. There's two bunny rabbits. I don't think I'm sneaky enough. There's a chipmunk. Oh my God, it's a wild chase. The chipmunk is chasing the bunnies. And they're gone. There's the bunny. I don't know if you can see him right there in the middle. But I think they dodged the squirrel and they made it out alive. Run bunnies, you're free. Let's see how close I can get. He knows I'm here. He knows exactly what's going on. There he goes. Hi. Bye. Okay, there's literally bunnies everywhere. Another one right here in front of me. Might be able to just barely see him. And there he goes. 
I guess they don't like humans. Maybe I smell that or something. Oh wait, they don't have big noses, they have big ears. Maybe he hates the sound of my voice. Maybe that's what it is. Fuck. So just a tip for everyone when you're walking around in nature, you might get caught up with the beautiful skies and greenery around you, but always, always watch your step. Especially if you care about your shoes. We don't want to be tracking that all over the place. Like an oasis in the desert. A lone porta potty. But just what I needed right now. Wish me luck. Whew. Oh. And we're out. Fresh air though. Oh, you never can truly appreciate it until you've been through hell. All right, let's keep going. So it looks like I just might be nearing the end of the trail here. It's been quite a journey. We've come pretty far. It's been a nice, nice little stroll in the park, you know? I think it's something everyone can can appreciate. Looks like I've worked up a little bit of a sweat. The sun, the exertion, but uh, it feels good. I hear it's good for the skin too, so can't complain. I guess I forgot to mention, I have no idea <laughs> where the hell I am, but that's that's part of the fun, right? The excitement of finding your way home. Oh, actually, you know what? I think I recognize these uh, these railroad tracks here. I can follow them to the promised land. All right. I'm on my way home. <laughs> 